Hello, I'm Lydia Westbrook and the instructor for your online tourism course this summer. I love teaching tourism because it's an industry that's ever-changing in today's dynamic world. An event on one side of the globe can affect travel patterns in a completely different part of the planet. The subject of tourism is not static, it's a com constantly moving force. Keep in mind, however, that this course is from an industry perspective and not the consumer view. You're not going to learn how to get the cheapest airfare or discounts on hotels and cruises in this course. What you will learn are the major fundamentals of tourism development and organization. We'll also look at the various impacts the industry has on tourist destinations. Examples of tourism in action will be used throughout the term. For example, while I'm recording this, the World Cup soccer tournament is happening in Brazil, where 3.7 million visitors are expected to spend almost $3 billion during the World Cup. That's a huge impact that testifies to the power of sports tourism. The text for this course is the Tourism System 7th edition and is available at the UH Bookstore. However, cheaper copies are available for rent from Amazon.com and Barnes & Noble. You should order yours immediately if you haven't already. The Hilton College Library has the sixth edition of the text on reserve, so you certainly can make plans to come uh, visit the library until you get your own copy. Modules have been set up in Blackboard Learn for a, on a weekly basis. Every Monday there will be an online quiz over the modules on the previous week. Please note that the final exam for this course is optional and you have the choice to substitute your final exam for one of your weekly quizzes. The main project for this course is an analysis of the tourism industry in a country of your choosing. Most of the weekly online assignments this summer will help you compile the information you need to submit the finished project, which will be in a PowerPoint slide format. You also have a tourist attraction site visit assignment, which involves visiting a tourist attraction and critiquing it from a visitor's point of view. These major components of the course and your grade will be due on the final days of the class, Monday and Tuesday, August 11th and 12th. There will be no late submissions for these projects, so plan accordingly. Online courses give students greater flexibility in accomplishing their academic goals. At the same time, there is more responsibility for managing your own time. You are expected to keep up with the weekly readings and assignments, so plan your time accordingly. Our class has a mandatory Facebook group to use for announcements, answering questions, informal discussions, and sharing. Your first task for this course is to join the Facebook group and post a short introduction of yourself. I would also like you to find something special or something notable from a classmate's introduction and comment so you can get to know each other. I'm on campus five days a week this summer, so please don't hesitate to come by and introduce yourself in person. My office is in the North Wing Faculty Hallway, room 231A. If you need to speak in detail about something course related, please make an appointment. I hope you enjoy studying tourism as much as I enjoy teaching it. Thank you and let's have a great term.